release. Drug agents in Matthews County are searching for a man they say sold them bath salts in a convenience store parking lot. 26-year-old George Wayne Sharp Jr. now faces drug charges. Ten in your size, Ann McNamara is here to explain exactly what was sold. Ann, obviously it's not the uh, bath salts you put in the bath at home. It's different. There's a specific, specific uh, synthetic stimulant in the bath salts, and that's what makes them illegal, Stephanie. And this is an important case for the Matthews County Sheriff's Department because it's the first time the Tri-Rivers Drug Task Force has ever purchased this bath salt illegal substance on the streets. The sheriff says the man sold illegal bath salts to agents twice in March, and now they're asking for the public's help in tracking him down. Here's a picture of that suspect, 26-year-old George Wayne Sharp Jr. The agents say he goes by the nickname Guy. The Sharp sold the illegal bath salts to Matthews County Drug Task Agents in this parking lot. Many people getting gas there today told 10 on your side they haven't heard of the drug. The sheriff says traditional bath salts like the kind you mentioned, Stephanie, that you would use in your bathtub, they aren't illegal, but in the past few years, criminals have been mixing those salts with that synthetic drug, and it gives a high very similar to cocaine. It can lead to uh, death and, you know, mental or physical damage as well, and then finally death. So it is a very dangerous chemical. It is a Schedule One, has no good use other than, you know, it's an illegal drug. Only used for illegal purposes. And the sheriff says Sharp fled Matthews County, and he could be hiding somewhere in Hampton Roads, of course, asking for the public's help in finding him. He also said it's possible federal charges could be filed in this case, depending, of course, on the circumstances of the sale and on Sharp's criminal history. And McNamara, 10 on your side.